touch me, touch me, touch me. I like the way she fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Hit it, hit it, hit it, drop, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it. What's good with you two? This your boy CJ. And this your girl Rena. Make sure y'all subscribe to CJ and Rena. Alright, today we got a reaction video on Izzy. Is it? World history. Izzy. Is it? Izzy. Is it? Izzy. Is let me stop that. That sounds like I'm gonna be in this category. Nope. Okay. Eddie is it. Let's get it. Uh guys, don't forget to donate the bottle so we keep going, going to go. I know you're already ready. I'm ready. Let's get it. All of Europe, you must do this. Well, we're not gonna. Um, we're gonna have a sandwich. Yeah. Yeah. And Germany and Japan, they, they do seem to have a natural instinct uh, in a very generalized way for organization and, and being military. But the, you know, there's a very strong Green Party there now. There's kids with beards. It's getting okay. And uh, I just think that J Japan and Germany should be the, 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 the peacekeepers of the world. They should be parachuted in whenever something breaks out. Parachute Germans and Japanese in. We'll go, look, we've done this before. We've done the killing. Hello. Take it from us. Just chill, chill out. All right? <laughs> and that they organize peace really efficiently, really quickly. All right. Peace, peace, peace. Peace is organized. It'd be brilliant if they could do it. That's their destiny, man. Yeah. And Italy invented fascism in 1922. Mussolini said, right, we're all fascists, but most Italian people are always on scooters going, ciao. <laughs> 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 and they're into football and life, and they're not fascists. You know, they said, we're all fascists. Uh, all right, ciao. <laughs> <laughs> no helmet on. <laughs> all those 50s films like Roman Holiday. It's just like that. Everyone's just cool and hangs out. So after the Second World War, the whole you know, world was going, come on, Europe, give these countries back. Come on, you know, we've had a bloody war, let's give them back. <laughs> Britain, what? <laughs> What's that behind your back? Oh, it's India and a number of other countries. <laughs> <laughs> give them back. Oh, all right, there's that one, there's that one. <laughs> Falkland Islands. Oh, we need the Falkland Islands <laughs> for strategic sheep purposes. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. And then it was a case of no empire, no longer. But in, in America it was different. The founding fathers landed in 16... Both of them. <laughs> they set off from Plymouth and landed in Plymouth. How lucky is that? <laughs> this is Plymouth? <laughs> We've just come from Plymouth. <laughs> We've gone round the circle. That's back on the bus. <laughs> They finally got there and said, ah, this is where our God has brought us to. We can, we can practice our religion here. We can raise a family. There's nobody here. Excuse me. There's nobody <laughs> here. <laughs> yes, a land empty of human existence. Who the fuck are these guys? <laughs> What's all this, please? <laughs> no, we don't want any of your food, thank you very much. <laughs> Just put some clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile... Meanwhile, that winter, excuse me, do you have any food? <laughs> I love all this, lovely idea. <laughs> yes, I'm sorry, we're a bit brusque when we first arrived. We didn't realize you owned the entire country. <laughs> but you have no system of ownership. Hmm, interesting. Um, maybe that can come in useful later. Food, thank you very much, very much. Yes, there's more of us coming, but we all keep our promises. So the American government lied to the Native Americans for many, many years. And then President Clinton lied about a relationship. And everyone was surprised. <laughs> a little naive, I feel. <laughs> we, when we were kids, we lied our heads off. I didn't do it. I was, I wasn't, I was dead at the time. <laughs> I was on the moon. It was Steve. <laughs> and your dad's going, I haven't even accused you of anything, yes? Oh, all right. What? What? What's the question? What, I, I, what, what? Did you brush your teeth? No. Yes. Wait, that's correct. And it what? Yeah. I was dead at the time. <laughs> then, when you're more mature, you do start telling the truth in odd situations. I'm sorry. I've broken a glass. I've broken this. Is that an expense? I, I'll, I've broken. It. I'll pay for that. I'm sorry. And you do that so that people in the room might go, "What a strong personality that person had." I like to have sex with people with strong personality. <laughs> And I broke other things, I've smashed that, and, <laughs> and that's gone, and I've just thrown the cat out the window, and... Ooh, yeah. 
So, but, you know, perjury. Um, you know, if you commit perjury, I don't care. Don't give a shit. I don't think you should because you grade murder. You have murder one, murder two. You realize that there can be a difference in the level of murder. So there must be a difference in the level of perjury. Perjury one is when you're saying there's no Holocaust when, you know, 10 million people have died in it. And perjury nine is when you said you shagged someone when you didn't. You know. It's, <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah. Hey, is it? That was funny. He did his thing. No lie. No lie. Guys, y'all definitely, oh man, he, he really funny. Y'all really need to check him out because he really got some good stuff going some on. Some good jokes. Yeah, so make sure y'all check him out in that description below, comment below, and also donate below so we can keep going, going, and going. Make sure you guys subscribe to CJ Arena. Yes! Like always, guys. Peace. Bye. I like the way she touch me, touch me, touch me, touch me. I like the way she fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Hit it, hit it, hit it, drop, hit it. Hit it, hit it, drop.